I don't know what I'm looking like right now. <laughs> now I look like I just climbed out of the jungle. That's... <laughs> I just can't do it right now. Perfect. So today I'm doing a mystery unboxing. My collar is messed up, I didn't realize. Yeah, you're gonna find out what it is. So this first item is probably the most boring item of the whole thing. I don't really know why I did this. Because <laughs> I'm stupid, that's why. I just wanted to like get a bunch of random stuff. So I ordered this and yeah, it was from AllegroMedical.com. And it's basically just this giant band-aid. It's actually a film dressing. And I think I'm going to put it on. I hope it doesn't like hurt or anything. But yeah, this site was sketchy as hell. They had like all these um, fake things to try and get you to sign up for stuff and try and get you to like buy stuff. And I could tell that it was like targeted towards old people who don't know what they're doing and don't know how to work computers. Because I ordered this. It was $1.11 by the way. I ordered it and they sent me an email that was like confirming. Confirming the order and then they sent me another email that was like hey make sure to come check out you have some stuff left in your cart I was like no I don't like I literally checked out five minutes ago and there's nothing left in my cart and they're just trying to get you to go and buy the stuff in your cart which is not in your cart but they made it up and they're trying to get you to buy it and then also when I was checking out they had this like pop-up ad with one click <laughs> With one click, you can add this to your cart. And it was like a $200 couch. Like, I go to buy a Band-Aid, a big Band-Aid, and they want to sell me a $200 couch. Like, usually when they do that, it's like, oh, for 99 cents, you can get a custom bag. But no, they, they were like, $200 couch. Like, that's what you want. So this is what I bought. It's a Meepore film. And you just put it on. So, yeah, this is what it looks like. I don't know. So yeah, I just got my vaccine, not my vaccine, what are those? IV ripped out and this is what I got. It's funny, I like it. It's like clear, but it makes you feel like you have a band-aid on. <laughs> Ew, it's weird. It's like all rubbery. So the next thing I ordered was from eBay and it was basically just this like little head. I don't know what they're called. It was like a flower crown, but it's like a really cheap elastic flower crown. And it was from China and it was 99 cents. But I did have to wait like literally a month for it to get here. So I'm gonna open it. <gasps> oh no! I dropped it. Ooh, this is exciting. Oh, it's so small. That is really not as big as I expected. There's somebody's hair on it. That is actually disgusting. That is really gross. Thank you. Well, that's kind of cute. That's actually super cute. I put my hair down. Okay, maybe not with my hair like. <laughs> That. That is so hot. <laughs> Let me style this in the, in the camera. I mean, the mirror. And for this look, the hippie look, it's actually kind of cute, not gonna lie. Come and see the picture. Oh. What is that? Why did that come out? My hair. I'm glad my hair looks just like this. Like, I'm so. Oh my god, it's knotted! I remember this girl in my school. She used to have this headband that was like this, except instead of flowers, it had like fake hair. And it looked like like it was braided hair. So when she would put it on, it looked like she braided her hair and like did a cool hairstyle. And then really she just got one of these headband thingies. And it was actually super awkward. Let's slob on my knob real quick. I'm literally gonna bust this thing. Like it was only 99 cents. How is it this durable? <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, the last thing I bought. I must say that watching Les Miserables. And all they do is sing, and they sing just like that. I don't want your love. I just want your baby. Yeah, so the last thing I bought is a book.
book from Thrift Books <coughs> for five dollars and seventeen cents. So basically, Thrift Books is an on. Just kidding. No, seriously. What I really liked about this um, Thrift Books place, well, maybe it wasn't. I think it was just for this particular copy because they had so many. But what was cool is. See, like, on Amazon when you order a book, you have the option of saying, like, paperback or hardback. So I went through and picked the cover that I wanted. This is so cute. This is exactly what I wanted. <laughs> this is actually really cute. I'm nutting. So I got this book called Babel Tower by A.S. Bryant. And this is the cover I picked. Isn't it cute? I was like, I saw it and I was like, honey, that's cute. Let me take these stickers off. That's awkward that they still have the half price. $2 uh, clearance sticker on here. It was such a good book that it was on clearance, you know what I'm saying? Like, clearance at half price, you know it's bad. I know you're stealing. I would like to personally thank, um, Half Price for doing this to me, ruining my beautiful cover, and since this is a paperback, I can't wipe it, so apparently there's a naked man. My mom just told me there was a naked man on the cover. I did not notice that, so sorry that it's 18 plus in this video. <laughs> anyway, so I don't really know what this book is about at all. Oh, it's A.S. Biot. Did I say that? I think I said Bryant. <laughs> that is not right. Babel Tower by A.S. Biot. Is it Biot or Bat? Or maybe the B silent at each Yacht? What the? Okay, this sounds pretty cool from the back. I don't know if I'm going to like it, though. It's so long. I didn't know it was this long. 600 pages? That is a long book, girl. <laughs> I'm about to sludge through this. SLUDGE! Gugan <laughs> is my best friend. I love him. I love him. Gugan is my best friend. <laughs> it literally looks like cooking oil. I wonder if it's the same thing. Like, what if I just wrote cooking oil? Wouldn't that just... Okay, well, that's a little bit better. It's not as noticeable. <laughs> So, I don't know where it cut off, but um, basically, yeah, this is the best I can do, taking off the goo junk. But I'm so excited to read this book. It actually kind of sounds cool. I hope I like it, otherwise that would be really awkward. So, that's the end of my video. I loved this mystery unboxing. It was so fun. I got this chic new headdress. A new book. Ha! Sorry, I just had a... <laughs> okay, bye.